to this Hunter Mr. 83 here coming with a new vid here. I haven't done a vid in a while. I know, I know. I apologize. I'm sorry. But I've just been loving doing the lives. If y'all not there, y'all should be there. It's awesome. We have all types of conversations. Sneaker battles, everything. Um, I mean, if y'all following, y'all be seeing me that I'm mostly live. And trust me, it is good to watch it. If you don't want to watch, if it's too long, sometimes just watch it in a 1.5. It's even funnier. Um, if y'all don't know what I mean, that's the speed of the video. You go to the options and you can do it there. I know, uh, I'm not trying to say, uh, you know, but that's just sometimes how I even watch it. Shout out to Zaya for that. Um, um, Zaya X. Yeah, if y'all don't know who Zaya is, y'all go check them out too. Shout outs to everybody, everybody in the so called section eight. And that's, I guess, what we're part of down here. Um, but, anyways, let's get into it today. We're here for all the pickups of 2020, the Ewing pickups. Um, and my favorite pickup of all the Ewings. And. To me, that one pickup is basically my favorite sneaker of the year. To me. Um, there's the other ones too, but this one is just, I don't know what it is about it. Um, but let's get into it. Um, we have, I want to start with this one. Because this one is, again, going to be with me forever. Basically, until, or until they melt, you know, get destroyed. Because um, this was a gift. Uh, from Tamir for Life, shout outs to him for doing the 25 hour live. It's not up anymore, y'all. YouTube took it away from me. It is what it is. Uh, we'll do it again soon. Um, but bam, we got the Sunflowers, aka the Timbos, aka the Wheats, aka, dang, these are beautiful. Did wear them in the snow and I got, you know, again, shout out, oh, you know what, shout out to Ewing Squad, too, and, and, and Throwback King, um, aka Fatboy Snacks, um, bruh, um, a lot of people in <laughs> Ewing Squad were like, what are you doing? And this has Prepper Tech, y'all can see the suede is still good, you know what I mean? The suede is still good, if y'all can see, y'all see that, you know, still really good. Um, dope sneaker, really good winter sneaker. Just put some crap protect, or if you have the other wheat ones, the ones that are like a boot, but they didn't release those this year again. They released the black pair, but they didn't release the the wheat pair. I guess because they gave us this, which I'm happy. This is such a beautiful sneaker. I got a lot of compliments for this sneaker, y'all. A lot, but anyways, I don't want to waste too much time on just one sneaker. Um, but again, shout out to Tamir for life for the gift, bro. Thank you so much. And for always supporting. And he even got some Ewings now, which is dope. He has a nice little Ewing row collection, man. Um, he doesn't really show too much of it, but if y'all do want to go watch, uh, see any of his sneakers, he's on IG. Um, it's yeah, Tamir for life. Um. And then we're going to go to one that, a model that I never tried, but I, I I got and have no complaints. The only thing is putting them on. It's a little different for me, and that's the Focus. This is my first pair of Focus. I am trying to get all the remixes, y'all. I'm only missing one more remix, and that is the, the Cross. I'm missing the Cross. I need the Cross in a size 13 or 14. I don't know how they fit. This one is, I think this one is a 13, so it was good. I say true to size on these. Um, very, it's a lot lighter than um, the Ewing 33 High. I will recommend this sneaker. It's dope on feet too. I got a lot of compliments on these, even though we're going COVID and that suede in the back is just dumb, yo. Man, they do good with these remixes. I love the remix line. Um, if y'all been following me, y'all know I love it. Um, ever since the 33 high. Right now, the 33 high is still my favorite. And I'll show y'all my second favorite, which I just got. 
Jesus, I should have took these out of the box. But it is what it is. Yeah, us Ewing guys know. You know, again, shout out to Ewing squad. But here we go. I did wear these two already. So, throwback king. Don't get to me. You know, don't get, you know. Throwback king is like, yo, you got to wear your sneakers. <laughs> I do. And this is the Sport Light remix. Oh, my goodness. I love this sneaker. Stupid light. Like, man, I, I, I forget I have Ewing's on. Or even sneakers on in general. This is almost as light as my, um, what were they called? Oh, shoot. You see, I did wear them. Y'all see that? Jesus. Um, uh, these are almost as light as my boost, you know, um, it's pretty crazy and it's comfortable too. I wore these all day one day and I wore these twice already. Uh, y'all know me, I try to take care of my sneak. I have so many. And, man. Super dope. Super dope, man. I will recommend anybody who doesn't want the big bulk. They, they, they want to try something new. And they want to try Ewing. But they can't go with how bulky and how big the Ewing 33 high is. I would say go with the Sport Light. I mean, the details on a sport light. I mean, on this one, you can barely see because of the uh, clear, icy blue sole. But the details on the sneaker, or even on the on the uh, Focus, really good. Um, So, before we get to the other ones, let's get to some of the older pickups. Uh, well, old used pickups. I did get these used. Um, one was worn once. The other one, it, to be honest, we wore multiple times. But I didn't think these were going to release, but I found out that we might be getting these sooner than I thought. And let's just get into it. We got the bread. You ain't 33 high. I will be getting these when they re release again. That way I could beat the crap out of these. Um, this is the last retro they did of them. I'm kind of happy that the new book hasn't cracked yet. Um... And for those who, if I'm not wrong, and Ewing can, uh, if anybody from Ewing is watching this, if I'm not wrong, that's the release date right there, right? Hold on, let's see if I could. Well, I think this says uh, 10, 10, 15. So I'm guessing that that has to be the release date. I think these released back in 2015. Um, I did not get them, but I got them now, and I got them for a good price, a really good price. Um, and I'm happy I did, but I want the black and yellow ones too. I need these to release again. Um, and I want the NYX colorway. The NYX colorway like this looks amazing. Uh, where the red is, is orange, and where the black is, is blue, and it's suede. Oh, man. But uh, to what I heard from a little birdie, we'll be getting these back sooner than what y'all think. That's what I'm saying. Sooner than what y'all think. So, I think this is such a dope sneaker. Is this better than the uh, the all red, the red suede? <sighs> it's a big debate, but it, it, the color blocking is. <clears throat> the only thing I will say with these is like... Ewing, that new bug that y'all put in the tongue right here, in the bottom of the tongue right here, put it up here too. This is a little rougher. And then this leather, make it a little bit better leather. Like, it's not bad. I've had worse, trust me. I've had worse. But, like, make it a tumble leather. Oh, man, that would be so dope. Um, and then the new bug is straight. Listen. The new book, I never have really complained. Like, all the black new book on this sneaker, it's ridiculous. Never done a review on this one, but, you know, it was a she I bought it used, yes. And, again, it barely looks like it. Ugh. Y'all see, I did wear them multiple times. This is in a rotation right now. Um, and they're still in really good condition, you know. Um, well, I did buy them to beat them up, you know. And then, 
Something that I know that they'll probably never release again, but if they do, hopefully, you know, I will double up. And your boy got the pigeons. You got another, excuse me, the whole controversial thing going on behind uh, Staple uh, recently, but I think this sneaker was always dope. I regretted not getting it. I think I've sent it multiple times. This is one that I regret, but I got it. I had an opportunity. To, I did pay a little over retail, if I'm not wrong. Um, but it's all good. And it was worn once, y'all. Like, literally worn once. Um, but I wore them. I wore them like crazy, yo. Look at that. <laughs> Damn, it looks better on, 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 on screen than it does in person. But I wore them. Put crap attack on them. And, bro, I love these. They look so good on feet. They look so good on feet, man. But I will be getting another pair of tea ever release because, again, I doubt it. Um, I don't think Staples is doing another collab with Ewing. But these are the pigeons. And I agree with some of the guys. Um, it's just funny. Like I said, some of the guys have even gotten this. Um, dang, this, the material are really good on some spots. Um, but anyways... Um, they should have done a little bit more detail on a pigeon, you know, or at least on this pigeon right here. On the one right here. Like, put more detail on that one, at least. On that one. Um, you know, Ewing, if y'all do this one again, release it the same way, same color and everything. Just fix that little pigeon. Um, it's dope. Flock with us. Really dope. I love this sneaker. Oh, and this one has the pigeon too back here. So... Very dope, very dope sneaker. A lot of small details in it. It is reflective too. Suede. I love this sneaker. No joke. And people are gonna people are gonna get pissed when I say this. These are better to me than the pigeon dunks. To me. Well, even though I prefer the purple pigeons over the regular pigeons, but and the purple pigeons technically are not pigeons. They just Y'all know the history if y'all know. But um to me. I love the way this one looks more than the pigeon, the pigeon dunk. But that's just to me, y'all. That's just to me. But um, the only thing I can see why the pigeon dunk is better is the detail on that pigeon is just dope. Like, they should have done that to these. But that's the only complaint I have. So shout out to D. Blake because I agree with him. D. Blake got himself a pair and they're just dope, man. It's a dope piece. Um, So let's get to... The Pierre de Resistant, almost. I'm gonna show you guys. Not this one yet. We'll do that one to last. Um, I've not worn these. Please don't get mad at me. I don't know if I want to wear them. It's almost like a, 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 a display piece to me, and it is a big pun. Shout outs to again Ewing Squad. Um, yo, Miss. Um, I don't know what, what your name is, Miss Pun. Please let them keep doing collabs with Big Pun. I know that she's trying to pull away from, you know, anymore. They've done enough. They've done four sneakers, you know, for him. I think they should just keep going. There's so much that they could do with him. You know what I mean? This one is right here. Like, in fact, with this one, this is uh, for the patent leather jacket he wore. The red leather jacket he wore. Yo, I don't know. Y'all can't tell. Yeah, y'all can tell a little bit there. Y'all see that pearlization? It's like a rainbow pearl on there. It's crazy. Sneak, I love it. But again, to me, it's a display piece. And I regret not doubling up on these, but there were so many other things I wanted to get. Again, I don't only love Ewing's. I love all brands. Um, Do I prefer Ewing right now? Yes, I love a lot of Ewing. Ewing is killing it this year. They're sleepers. And I love it because when I wear them, I don't see 20 other people wearing the other same sneaker. You know what I mean? I could be in a room of a thousand people and I'll be the only one wearing Ewing's and I'll still have a, you know, start a conversation and everything. But this sneaker is ridiculous, man. The details on this one are so dope. If y'all didn't cop these, y'all tripping, man. I'm not going to say sneaker of the year, but... But again, like I said, Ewing, if you're watching this, and um, Miss, I don't want to, you know, I don't know how to call you, because I know his son's name is Little Pun or something like that. Um, 
But, um, ma'am, if you let them come, because, listen, he loved wearing denim. That's another one they could do for him. Like, the denim joint. There's so many things that, that was dope. They already did the Puerto Rican one. They could have done a reverse Puerto Rican flag one for him. Because um, I ain't going to lie, that last one was more like a Cuban flag. No offense, because it was mostly blue. And we all know that the Cuban flag, the Cuban flag is mostly blue. That should have been a little bit more red because it's the Puerto Rican flag. Um, the 100% jump. Um, but, you know, it is what it is. That's just some ideas out there. So hopefully you let them do that again. That way they can keep going with the whole, um, the puns. Bam. And talking about big pun, this is the last one. So what I heard, this is the last big pun we're going to see. There's not going to be no more. I'm still, I'm trying to work right now and getting the yellow pair. I need to get the yellow pair. The 100% pair, I don't know if I want still. Because of the whole Puerto Rican flag. And I feel weird. I'm not Puerto Rican. And rocking a Puerto Rican flag. I don't know. I feel like I'm disrespecting Puerto Ricans, you know. Um, But here we go. This is the my pickup of the year. My sneaker of the year. And we have the bla the black big puns. I still call these the uh, Capital Punishment 2.0s. Um, they came in the same box. I don't know if Capital Punishments came out in the same box as these. I don't think so. I think it was different. But this one has a similar box as the red patent leathers. But, oh man, I love this sneaker. The yellow stitching all around. That big pun embroidering in the back. Come on, man. That is just killer. Now, what I would have said this is back here, they should have made this yellow and red. Um, you know, or kind of like the way the big pun was here. But it's straight. It's straight. That's the only thing. Other than that, this is like the perfect. This is up there with my purple Ewings. If not. Even better than my purple Ewings. I have not worn these. I might be picking up a second pair if I could wear one. Um, but I do want one on ice. Oh, man. This is dope. Like, this sneaker. Oh, man. I don't know what it is about it. And I'm from Maryland. If anybody knows from Maryland, this reminds you of Maryland colors. You know what I mean? I was born and raised in Maryland. And this is the colors of Maryland. So, I mean, the big part is that also, man. That also is killer. I can't wait to get the the, the Capital Punishment pair. Um, hopefully the deal goes through and I get that one. Um, but, because I don't think they'll ever release these again. Like any of the big puns. So if you have a big pun... Be lucky that you, you, you have them. You know what I mean? Any of them. Because um, even the Red Pat and others, they're going up in price. You know what I mean? Bam. The big puns, yo. Shoot. This is fire, man. Let's kind of stay there right there for a sec. Take that screenshot, you know. This might be the thumbnail, y'all. This might be the thumbnail. Oh, this is so dope. Um, but anyways, again, thank you. Thank you so much, everybody, for all the support. I don't want to make this video too long. Damn, we got 20 minutes already. So I'm going to get it done here. Dang, exposure is going crazy. Um, again, shout out to everybody who's been supporting this year. We're almost at 1,000 subs. Um, Ewing Squad, I'm going to try to be more active there. I just feel like sometimes it's not um, appropriate for me to put some stuff on there that does not have to do with Ewing. But um, I will be putting this one there. So if anybody does uh, have Facebook, please check out uh, uh, Squad. What is it? Squad 33 now? Um, check out the Facebook group. Uh, like 
that Facebook group is dope. We all help each other. We just hit one eight K, is it? Then we were at eight eight plus eight eight thousand plus um, members of that group. And bro, shout outs to y'all. We're growing. That is so dope. And again, if you have Facebook, go check it out. Like you you'll see some gems in there. And if you have any questions, everybody is willing to help you out um, with anything with a Ewing brand. Again, thank you everybody so much. Um, please come come to the lives, everybody who's watching this. And I know it's been making it a uh, it's been a while since I made a video, and hopefully this kind of makes up for it. And yeah, man, thank you again everybody for all the support. And until next time. You know, I'll see y'all. Um, more videos to come, y'all. 2021 is going to be different, but I did have to finish with a bang this year. Well, this is not going to be the finish because I do have one more video coming. Um, again, thank you, everybody, for coming through and, 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 and supporting the channel. And keep supporting, keep sharing, keep commenting, keep liking, and all that great stuff. And I will see y'all next time in the lives, or in the comments. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. God bless. Stay blessed. I'll see you next time. Peace.